Hi, I'm Yosuke. Today's video, I'm going to talk about four of my slumps, like when I couldn't paint and how I solved the problem. Sometimes people tell me I always paint and never stuck and I always have ideas, but uh, sometimes I have problems. First story I'm going to talk about is in my 20s to 30s I couldn't paint for like 10 years well I could paint but I never satisfied when I finished and I just add and redo it and add it and it's hard to finish one piece of work the reason was I was consider about other people's judgment or like uh, I was thinking about what is art or stupid things like this. And second situation was that was after the big earthquake 10 years ago. I just I was shocked and just didn't feel like to paint for a little while. The third situation, that was about eight years ago. I got too lazy to paint. Fourth situation, I had personal problem. And um, my life was in mess. First one, I was just young and stupid. I didn't have any confidence. That's why I worried about what other people think and uh, if my work is good enough so when I finish, I just, eh, it's not finished, it's not, uh, it's not art. But after that, I had good friends and um, they, they believed, um, believed me. So um, I had a little confidence and also, you know, what is art? Is it right? And uh, it's, it's, that's also stupid, but I was thinking, I'm the art. So what I did, what I create is always correct. So I start painting. I painted Japanese old fashioned characters with my own style. And I wasn't still sure if I was doing the right thing, but I just did not care. And the finish, and the next, finish, and next. Not just Japanese characters. And I, I just painted. And uh, after that, I created many. That was the time I lived in New Mexico, USA. And I kept painting. And I think I improved. And and create different styles too and after six months I had my solo show and I think that was good improvement second one was after a big earthquake that was 10 years ago I was in Japan and um, there's tsunami and so many people died but in my neighborhood got didn't got that much damage but there was still in you know, a big shake and uh, lots of crack on the buildings and and uh, someone told me the, uh, another big one coming and I thought I'm going to die but I didn't but yeah, I, I didn't feel like paint for a couple of months. What I did, I start painting. No, this is drawing. Um, I drew on a small paper with colored pencil. And yeah, it is just colored pencil. And uh, those colors are beautiful. And um, yeah, I did one and two and three and many many and after that I, I could paint big ones and stuff too 
So just start from something easy. I, just, I think that changed and helped me. Third one, that was about eight years ago. I just start feel lazy about drawing or painting shapes. So what I did was making collage. I painted on the background and uh, those are, I cut things from magazine and so I didn't have to draw and that was fun and um, I just start doing those but you know after looking for what to cut I start feeling lazy about finding a source uh, that's it I haven't made collage after that but I think collage was fun and uh, I think making collage, drawing, painting, I think it's still creating work. So I think I changed the technique or changed the art supplies that helped me, I think. And I still change like watercolor to oil, oil to acrylic or maybe sometimes make sculptures, sometimes make print making or uh, do different things uh, that helps me. Fourth one, I had a, some problem in my personal life and then my emotion was uh, not very, uh, I was crazy maybe and uh, whatever I paint it's just mess. This is one of a drawing at the time. It's so messy. But just now I look at those are pretty interesting. What is that? Uh, <laughs> That's checking. What is that? <laughs> Cat. That was a hard time for me, and I wasn't happy, but it just that I could find myself, different side of myself, and uh, just I could create different stuff from when I was just just regularly happy. So um, this, these drawings actually helped me to found my new style. After I did those drawings, that helped me to create my new styles. I mean, those, whatever bad happenings, can spice things up and it just helped my improvement. Making this video I found me my old old drawings and stuff and those are fun and I, uh, I forgot about those but uh, it's fun to look at. What is that? <laughs> uh, well I hope you enjoy and thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.